Hello everyone, welcome back to Ocean Block, episode 11. Today, we are going to do a little bit of exploring under the water, under the sea. So, um, I've been working on a few things uh, since last episode. Uh, I've been playing around with the ME cable, or the ME system, uh, with auto crafting. Uh, I've learned a few things. Um, apparently, uh, as you can see here, I, I made some modifications. Um, each branch of the ME controller can handle up to 32 channels using a dense smart cable. And then, meaning you can have 32 channels running off of the dense cable, each with its own channel. So you can have channels broken off of channels. Now, these flex or flux ME glass cables are only eight channels. So that's why we were running into issues last time. Um, where some of these are not turned on, like this guy here is not turned on. So I made some modifications. Um, still not going to work unless I build some more um, dense smart cables, which I'm going to work on getting the materials. I just don't have a lot of them at the current time. So I've uh, been messing around with it. That's why it looks a little goofy here. Um, so you can see here that there's six of 32 channels used up and that's because I have one single runoff of here and then these are all connected. So it's, it's a little goofy back here. You can see that I've got some diamond, um, plants, mystical farm plants, whatever you want to call them, uh, going back here because I need I need diamonds. I have like pretty much run out. So we're going to be working on exploring. Um, but I, to, to do more of the things I want to do with uh, the mystical agriculture, I need diamonds. So um, I got those going. I messed around with... Uh, I put some tanks on here because the... Um, the sludge was building up um, already in this first tank and it was full. So I'm hoping that this will fill up the two top and then it'll fill this one and then we'll maybe have time to figure out what we're going to do with these. Um, but other than that, I'm trying to think if there's anything else. I don't think there was anything else besides my experience. <laughs> so... I went and oh no, there's two things. I went in exploring, and I found a an experience uh, pearl, com a compressed experience pearl. I think it was an eight times. I could be wrong, and maybe it was. Yeah, it was definitely only one. And I clicked on it thinking because I I've, I've gotten these small smaller compressed ones, and they only give me a couple experience. Well, apparently <laughs> the eight times. Gives you a ton of experience. So I have 6,124 levels. <laughs> so um, maybe work on doing some enchanting. I'd like to get a silk uh, pickaxe or like a silk shovel so that mm, I think we can pick up these blocks. And I want to reorganize this at some point in time um, and really focus some of these um, maybe maybe only have one uh, sower per um, nine section and then kind of go from there because the interface is only set up for nine and I'd like to have a little bit more control over what I'm planting um, in, in each one of these locations. Plus, I also want to, I want to get these growth accelerators a little bit more um, um, a little bit more organized and some of them I want to you know I want to get more of the well, more of the other accelerators so that the speed up the, the growth even faster because uh, we definitely need inferium seeds and I've been 
getting those, or not seeds, the essences, quite a bit, but they go really fast. So, especially when you're combining everything. Um, oh, and one other thing I did add was this ender chest that was sitting here all the time. I entered that into our, our ME system. You can see our drives are filling up here. Uh, we only have one one drive that's pretty good and one that's not so good. So we're going to have to probably look at getting some bigger drives or more drives uh, here shortly or another storage system. Um, but what this ender chest does is imports all the items into our system. And I have an ender pouch here. So if we go in here and we say, I want to put this pork chop away, it just gets sucked and puts into the ME system. So, which is really nice. Um, so when we're out and about and I, I'm running out of space, I don't have to put anything in our backpack here. This is kind of just like all my books and tools and things that I'd like to keep uh, on hand. And the Ender Pouch allows us to keep everything kind of cleaned up. So, um, so first of all, I'd like to spend <laughs> and add some trinkets. Now, I did do some exploring off screen and I did find some more trinkets. So let's unlock a bunch of these. I don't know how many you can unlock, but I've got so many on, well, much XP, it's not even funny. So I can start adding a lot of these. Um, I guess I could probably just do all of them. See invisible entities, I've never, I, no, I, oh, I guess, I guess they can invisibility potion, uh, receive discounts for village traders, uh, dealing more knockback when hitting enemies. I, I don't really like that. Actually, <laughs> I wish they would stay kind of close, uh, but maybe I'd add that. Um, I guess that's fine too. Uh, these hearts are going to be kind of nice cause that's going to give us more health. You're withering enemies, which is fine. And then I'm not going to put uh, rock candy on because once I do, I just run really super fast. And especially when I jump to um, it's it's nice when we're when I'm kind of exploring around the top here uh, because you do swim really quick as well. So I can I can run around fast and uh, search the boats or rafts or whatever. So but for the time being, we will remove that. But we got all the other ones on, which is great. We'll see if we get the extra four, six hearts, maybe six hearts, seven, eight, two, is it two, four, six, eight, eight hearts. That's good. Nice. Um, what I'd like to do, uh, like I said earlier, is explore kind of under under the water a little bit. I didn't really do that much. Uh, they have a sea moth, and I, I think I mentioned this in another episode where uh, you can, it's almost like Subnautica if you ever played it. Um, sea moth is one of the vehicles that you can use, and this will allow us to have oxygen underwater, I'm, I'm assuming. And we're going to need a power cell for that. Um, I also upgraded the, the oxygen tank, so it gives us a larger capacity, which... Uh, is really nice when you're going underneath the water. I did have to go underneath and try to get some... Um, it's one of the structures right below us has glowstone, and I need some glowstone for some of the recipes. But I'd like to make a rebreather, which gives us a, a maximum depth of 100 meters, as well as the improved wetsuit leggings would give us 30% um, mining speed. So we're underwater. I mean, we already have fast mining, but... Uh, this will make it almost pretty much instantaneously. And maybe we won't like it at all. I don't know. We'll find out. So this is a pretty simple uh, build. I I need two of these, actually. So we'll take that. Oh, I need a hundred. Uh, so might as well get these powered up. So we'll come in here. 
and we'll energize these. We'll, we'll do that one there. And energize that one there. And while that's going, let's take a look at the rebreather. So I've got everything. I've got other diving masks. So let's build the rebreather. And so we don't need that anymore. We don't need the power cell on the sea moth. Or actually, no, we do need to see the moth. And then wetsuit reinforced. Okay, cool. So let's replace our normal one. And then we also have the reinforced diving is another one I found. Uh, so I have the high capacity. So it's 120 seconds. So long time. The 30% and the fins. Actually, I think there's another set of fins. So there's the Ultra Glide. Ooh. Well, let's build them. We have the materials to do so. Okay. <laughs> wonder how fast we're going to swim now. Let's check on these. Ah, 100%. 100%. Good, good, good. So if we go back to our Sea Glide, or I'm sorry, the Sea Moth. Sea Glide is another thing in uh, having a uh, brain issue here. <laughs> Subnautica. So let's plop that in the water. Awesome. Do I right click on it to. How do I. Oh, wow. It has the same kind of information as like repair, power. So, okay, so it does have power cell. So when I was looking at this, it says no power cell. So they must have added that or something. I'm not quite sure. Now, does this have an inventory? No. So in the... Let me look in the options here. Um, I have to know the mod. Better driving. Or better driving or better diving? Better diving. Nope, just C for descent. Uh, the same audio and everything. Now, is there lights? Probably not. Okay, so that's out. Take it out. So I haven't really explored the bottom here too much, so I'm not sure exactly what we'll find. Like that. Okay, it's in here. I'm not sure what, if I can get damaged at all, like running into things. Uh-oh, uh-oh. That was not a good idea. <laughs> I hit the wrong button. Wilderness, huh. So what is... I get out without dying here. What is that? Oh, we actually we actually need that. Um, matter of fact, oh, there's more here. So we'll just vein mine this all up. And I think that's oh, well, that's granite. Yeah, I'll take all the granite. Um, get some light in here. Nope, there goes my... My light. Oh, my food is really low. Can't have that. Let's get the light back. Now, can I... Find my sea moth again. <laughs> oh, there it is. After I destroyed this place. 
Yes. Yes. Um, I think that's stone. This is, that's what we need there. So the other thing as well is I, I do have a magnet, uh, this fluxo magnet. I found that a while back in one of those crates. Um, so I'm just basically just charge that up and turn it on. So now I can just shove all this stuff in there and that will enter right into our, oh, we need andesite too. That gives us the uh, quartz dust that we need. All right, let's get out of here. Um, please, there we go. Oh, cool. So there's going to be, there's going to be things down here that we're going to need for crafting recipes. For sure. Wow, this is kind of a big cavernous area. What is that? I must ask. Is that dust? No, marble. Okay, I'll take some marble. I don't know if that's really useful for anything, but let's check back here. So we got some more marble, it looks like. You know, one thing I'm noticing is that there's no ores. So that's kind of a, a thing that I'm seeing so far. All right, let's get out of here. Let's uh, let's shove the marble. See, now this is all empty again. <laughs> so I should have tons and tons of space for exploring and whatnot. So I don't know why that's kind of glowing. There's got to be some cool things down here. Got to be. I mean, I I did see some rafts around the other place. So I'm going to keep an eye out for that. I do need glowstone dust. This is mainly just all coral. Now, since it's like Subnautica, is there going to be like, what 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 they have? They had uh, those mammoth beasts that were like attacking you. Can't remember what they're called. I don't want to go too far out. I need find. Oh, what do we got here? What do we got here? What do we got here? Uh, looks like mob spawners for sure. And that's one of our abilities that they just. <laughs> I wonder if I can get in there and. Ouch. Let's just swim around here and see what it looks like. So there is. Some crates in there. Oh, there's a crate right here. I don't think there's anything real useful in here. Besides mobs, but... No, nah, I don't want to die down here. Well, I guess it doesn't really matter. So there's another one nearby as well. Whoa, 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 whoa. Can I just, like, well, there's a bunch of water here. It's like them targeting and they can just die. Let's see if I can destroy them. 
Oh, come on, 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 come on. Let's scoot out of here. Oh, I can't scoot out of theirs. All right, I'm doing all right, I'm doing all right. Dip and dodge, dip and dodge. Oh, that was a creeper, it sounded like. Okay, okay, here we go. Let's get some food. What the heck? What the heck is that? All right, let's get these guys and see what we can find in here. You gonna die? Kaboom! All right, let's throw some light in here. I don't know why I'm moving so slowly. Hi, buddy. It's a blue barrel. Oh, we definitely got some more guests in here. All right, all right, all right, all right. This actually would be really cool for a, a base. <laughs> Where was that? Where was that guy that was? Did he die? Maybe. Where? Oh, oh, there you are. And I might actually do that. Is there? There's got to be like a spawner down here or something. No, I'm, maybe not. Just that they're stuck. Really? Where where you hit me from? Oh, hello, friend. There we go. What'd you get me? Oh, we got a, a stray skull. Arrow slowness. Oh, that's why. Oh, right now I have slow saturation too. Hmm. All new things. Terra steel ingot, obsidian. Let's see what the get out of that. Golden nuggets. I do. No, oh, I guess it's got to go on a saturation. So it's like food and like, is there like a debuff in this area as a whole? Maybe. Almost seems like it. But this is this is really cool. I mean, it looks cool in here. I want to kind of light this up a little bit. I mean, what do you think? Should we turn this into like a base? I'm looking to see if there's anything down here, but I really don't see anything. All right. Well, I guess I'll get this. Oh, this is going to have just the... Oh, I'm full already. How did, how did the ender pouch do that? Bones, sea pickles. Throw all those in there. Cool. And sea moth is right there. All right. Get out of there, because it's definitely a debuff. Now, there was another one. So south. Right there. I'm guessing it's gotta be well maybe it's not the same thing. Uh there's just different barrels in there. Is 
Let's see. Hmm. Like, is it really worth it? I mean, there's not really that good of... I guess the blue... Go, 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 go. Those hearts are really helping. Plus that other, uh, where I'm getting like half the damage. Just die. <laughs> I don't even see where half these guys are hitting me from. If it was dry in here, man, they'd all die from just... Die. Alright, we're I think this blue barrel I don't think we see very often, so let's uh let's light this up. So I can see these guys. Oh, that was under the water. Oops. My parkour skills are Lackluster. Okay. Where are you guys? My sword's about to break, too. Now, there's a... Some kind of effect going on right there. Is that... Is that me? Oh, it's saturation. Or is there a dude under here? Yes, there's a dude right there. Oh, the, it's the wither effect. My sword is about to break. Ooh, butcher. You own this trinket. Okay, we already own the trinket. Purple ones are good. Black ones, nope. I don't even know what the sea cucumbers are for. I think that was a mana diamond. Yep. Which, and we'll get rid of that. Oh, we got another uh, heart piece. And we already have Mind's Eye. You own this trinket. Okay, so I can't use that one again. I didn't want to do that. Let's put that on the hot bar. Actually, let's put all these ones I'm not going to keep on the heart, on the hot bar. I'm definitely not keeping that. And then these all can be shipped back. Goodbye. Doodoo. <laughs> oh, crap. I sent back my food. No. <laughs> all right. Well, we're going to have to go back and get some food. But these are cool. These are absolutely really awesome. I don't know about the swimming speed, if it's any different. So I want to go to the south? Yeah, to the south. So go over this. Yeah. So I'll be right back. I'm going to get back home, back to the base, and grab some food. Be right back. All right, I got my food back. Um, my sword's about to break. So let's throw that in there. Do we have any other swords? No. <laughs> um, I'm not exactly sure how to repair our sentient sword. Um, hmm. And that's about to go too. And that would probably get pretty powerful but let's take a look at well oh, sword so the sentient sword there we took we picked up some mana steel we don't have any of that
Certus Court. I mean, we do have some diamonds, and we are making diamonds, so we could just do like a diamond sword for the time being. Oh no, this item is only for crafting only. Oh no, so we almost have to use... We can do steel. Oh no, we got bronze. We Oh, that's 10 attack damage. Holy crap. So that's diamond. And this is for mystical agriculture. Interesting. Because that's really the next step up. How do you make this? Okay, so you just need the prosperity ingots. I wonder if we can make that. Let's Let's see. Make a bunch of those. Okay, I used up all the diamonds. Oh boy. Uh no, I can't make the diamonds. Uh the diamond. Oh, here we got enough. To, uh diamond sword. If I can speak. So let's close that up. Alright, that's four diamonds. Um so we do have four. So diamond sword. And then we need two of these guys. Oops. For the first round. And then we need two of these. Nope. We'll grab six of them. We'll see how far we can go. Ah, what am I missing now? Oh, I need to make these. One, two, three, four, five, six. <laughs> Perfect. Okay. First level. Second level. Basically the same thing, two of each. <clears throat> One, two, three, four, five, six. Ooh, we're out of those already. I'm just wondering why that doesn't grab. Oh, what happened to it? Did I use up both of them? I had one. Hmm. It was called like. No, oh, all right here, infusion crystal. I don't know why it didn't grab that. All right, so we got the okay. So we got that sword, which is going to be thrown into here. So we need two of these and two of these if we have enough. Yes, we do. Now we can craft that because we're going to grab that. So perfect. Can we go to the? Can we go to this one? So thirteen attack power. So we're missing. Some of these, so I need two, four, six, eight of them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Perfect. I think that's enough. Two. One, two. Yeah, he was level three. So level four would be nice, but I don't believe we have. But we do. How many do we have? <clears throat> we have four and we need six total. I don't think we'll have enough. So we will have to upgrade that at a later date. So we do have, and I I think I could probably upgrade it even if it's damaged. So that's kind of a thing. Um, 
actually going to throw the power cell in here. Um, let's charge. That's not what I wanted to do. Let's charge this baby bag up. All right. Get a snack. Oh, I was going to say get a snack before we go to bed, but we're going to bed. Bada bing, bada boom. All right. My saturation is still... I don't know if that's bugged or what. We did get a quest, though. Seamoth. Hello, laser. Goodbye. <laughs> that is that is awesome. So we hop back in our Seamoth. Now, that is the place I already kind of mined out. Let's check out this crevice. Oh, is that obsidian? Um, sure enough. Oops, that's obsidian. I'll take all this. Um, oh. Oh, tagging with the sword. <laughs> ow, 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 ow. I don't know what these will use, be used for, but take them with me. Let's go down. Let's get some more obsidian. I mean, I mean, I can make the obsidian, so it's not a big deal, but... Might as well grab it. Can while we're exploring. All right. We'll just ah, uh, that broke really quick. Got another one. That's probably gonna meet its own uh, the same fate. Hello. Magnet not working? I need to get a bigger or better magnet for sure. Well, we we'll just take all this. Okay. This. Some O2. It's so dark in here. Kind of lose your way. Stop it. I you kind of don't want to explore too much of these because with, I mean without their sea moth, because you don't know what's going to happen if you get like get lost. You can't throw any torches down. Plus, I don't see any uh, like ores or anything. That's gravel. I'm not a big fan of it getting dark like that. I mean, it's like, oh boy, is that my saturation still? It is. What's going on? Am I under? What's the depth at? Does it say? I don't know, but just not sure why I'm getting damaged. All right, let's get out of here. Where did I, where did I pick that one up at? Interesting. Okay, let's put all those in there. All those. All those. All those. I got some dirt too. Interesting. All right. Let's go other places. Not sure if the coral will be what in the world. Any use? Oh, here's one of those. 
little places here with the guardians. Um, I'm stuck. Come down here. I think there's a spawner right there. I believe there's a spawner up top. Yep, right there. Do do get all the gold blocks. Just mine everything out. I don't want that. What is this? Well, whatever it is, I'm taking it. Oh, sea floor. All right, let's grab these things. Man, I don't, oh, I don't have the saturation anymore. Oh, I am. Things are being pulled with me because of my magnet. <laughs> so it does work. Um, I got a. Wow, he's not attacking me. Interesting. I don't understand that. Well, those are kind of cool looking blocks. Oh, there's a spawner right there. Is there one over here as well? Oh, yeah, look at that. All right. Let's come down here and grab these. All right, stop, stop attacking me. I'm done. I'm leaving you. All right, let's take inventory here. Still attacking me. Stop it. Leave me alone. I thought there'd be a little bit more interesting things here, but the same as just caverns and... Oh, here's another one. Excuse me. Let's throw these in... I mean, this area looks a little different, but... Hmm. Alright, let's... Go out and get our loot. That, that, and that one. All right. Aha. Get own. Yeah, yeah. Does that hurt? Is that something down there? That's no, coral. Yep, 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 yep. Get owned. Okay. Let's get to strip mining here. That was easy. All the gold. We have gold for days. Gold for days. It's coral, I think. Um, again, why am I? No food makes no sense. All right, just give me a second here, guys. It's a book of something. All right. Oh, there's a. I didn't kill that. I thought I had that spawner dead already. Oh, he was giving me something. What was that? A shell. Hmm. Is that a, that's a Sims symbol? Uh, plum bob. Yeah. Oh, that's that was weird. Oh, what was that? Soul sand. 
That's cool. Okay. I think we kind of... Oh, let's grab these things down here. And the chains, maybe? I don't know. I would... What? What is this green? Dark prismarine. I don't even know if we really need that or not, so... Not really gonna go after it. But we do want all of that. More gold. Don't know what those shells are for, but they gotta be for something important. And what is this? No bookshelf needed for enchanting. Hmm. Uh oh. <laughs> I think we're full. I think we're full of some of these items. That might be a problem. Okay, we can add that. So, does that give us all? So we can do just all the enchanting without bookshelf. That's that's really cool. All right, we're we're definitely gonna have to build some more storage. I'm going to have to go and look and see what we need for... Oh, what is this? What is this? Blue. Uh, carpeting. Not fun. Maybe use it to spruce up the place at some point in time. Oh, another one. I'm not sure if we really... Well, we do need the soul sand if we can get it. So maybe I will. Alright. Sorry, buddy. Get out of my way. Oh, there's a green plum bob. Um. Oh, you you got it. I already got the hat. Then it must give you like the different varieties or different colors. Ow! Is that? Oh, it was this guy who was shooting at me? Oh boy! Did I get all the? That one's interesting. Okay. Thought I got all the spawners, but it seems like they keep on spawning. That one's gone. Oh, I didn't get I didn't get that one or this one. And there's a gold. Come here. Come here, big boy. What the heck? Okay. Uh, that was lackluster. I think we just got some cobblestone in that one. <laughs> Not what I'd want. Uh, fruit salad. Alright, let's hop in here real quick. Get our auction. Uh, excuse me. And we'll come out here and do our collection. All the things. Alright, do we get anything good here? I didn't get any soul sand. I don't think I did. All right, guys. Guys, cut it out. I'm leaving. I'm leaving. Goodbye. All right, let's 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 head back to the base. We'll search on the way back. See if there's anything of interest. 
Was there any soul sand there? No. But we got some spruce logs. Gold blocks. Gold for days. I think we're just gonna like build a golden base. Everything's gonna be gold. I mean, they did a really cool job with the sea floor and everything. Right, let me look at the map. All right, I'm going the right direction. Squids out of my way. I want to see what we can do with the resources that I gathered. Um, I can break them down into to other things that I might need. All right, where's my island? Oh, I am going past my island. It's right here. Hello, island. All right. No, we've got room, so why? Hmm. Maybe something just was processing a little bit longer. I don't know. I mean, we are getting full. Okay, that has full, so that has some types, that has some types, that has types, that has types, that one has types, that one has types. What the heck? Or no, I'm sorry, those are all full. <laughs> this has 0 of 63, so I have a, a 4k still full, so I can take 63 there. So we got a little bit of room, and I don't think any of these are... Yeah, they're... that's half full. That one's not... We have plenty of room. Uh, okay. So, cool. Um, so that's the sea moth and the swimming gear. And what else did we do? We built a, a sword and kind of talked about some of the things that I worked on. I'm going to work on the mystical added culture. I'm going to get a... Let's, let's do that real quick. We'll, we'll end this with a um, enchanting table. Can I make one? Can I make one? I need a paper. I got some sawdust. Okay. I mean, we have... Well, okay, first of all, we don't need to use... Oh, I need lapis. I always forget about that. And... Uh... We don't need to use any bookshelves, which is kind of nice. So what do we get? Throw that in there. Sharpness, unbreaking three, that would be nice. So actually it would be sharpness, knockback, unbreaking. Cool. What if I put I'll put that one in there. Let's put that one in here. Molten tool head. I I almost want to just do that. I don't know what it does. Does that? Okay, well, hold on. We got to test this. I'm guessing it will take like stone or like cobble and then make it into stone. So if we have that there, yep, that's what it does. That's kind of cool, in a way. Not really. <laughs> um, so, yeah, I guess we're going to end it there. We uh, we got the enchanting table. I think I have that. Yeah, no bookshelf needed for enchanting. So I'm guessing we're getting full chance now. Um, just got to get the right ones. I'll probably set up... Uh, Get a bunch of books, and we need some oak logs here. Um, probably put some stuff through the precise sawmill here. Get that going so that can pump out some uh, sawdust. I'll make some more books and just pump out a ton of enchants that we can use later on down the road. So.
All right, guys, thanks for watching. If you like the video, make sure you guys hit the like button. Uh, don't forget to subscribe, and we'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.